Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the first ever Virtual Vendies Award Ceremony. It's a pleasure to be here with you wherever you are. Uh, maybe you're even in a queue outside uh, Primark, for instance, which I, I'll be honest with you, I haven't missed. I, the one, the, one of the few things I've liked about being in lockdown is that I don't have to go shopping at all, and especially in Primark. Last time I was in London, uh, it was over a year ago, I went to Primark on Oxford Street, and I was in there an hour and a half just, just tidying up, to be perfectly honest with you. It's an absolutely dreadful place. It's practically a refugee camp in there. There's people dishing out polio vaccinations at the bottom of the escalators. It's a dreadful, dreadful place. But I'm, I, So I haven't been to London for a year. I haven't been to the UK for over a year either. I live in France and we're back in lockdown because that's that's what we like. Um, we, we've actually coped with lockdown really well over here because our history of industrial inaction and striking at the drop of a hat means we're used to not being able to do anything or go anywhere. And the government had helped us out massively by, um, they've been sending out very sophisticated social distancing measure, measuring tools. We have, uh, this, this is what they've been sending out. This is, this is the, your standard baguette. And as long as you're two baguettes away from the next person, you're, you're safe, apparently. This one's now nearly a year old. I could literally beat someone to death with that if they, if they got too close. We also had a French inventor who came up with the idea of, uh, he was able to turn unused wine into hand gel sanitizer, which is, you know, scientifically, that's a, that's a wonderful breakthrough. That everybody in France just looked at each other and went, what's unused wine that's that there's just it's just a concept that is alien to everybody so well done to be for being in the vendies as well which of course i mean for vending machines it's, you've had a good year i presume because people can't go into shops so much in france they've, 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 it hasn't really taken off in france before lockdown we now have you can get goat's cheese in a vending machine in the center of town which is fantastic and and pizzas and baguettes as well your own social distancing measuring tool coming out of a machine and 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 uh, you know and and things are starting to improve i see over there which is great but again you know i i don't i don't want to mingle just yet and the thing about lockdown is that i didn't have to tell anybody that i didn't want to go out and now i have to do that i'm not going out anymore i went when i was in london again last time um and this is the problem with being around people i was in tk max don't judge me on that i was in tk max and uh, i tried on these shoes and i walked around the corner to the shoe mirror and then i walked back to my shoes and somebody's trying on my bloody shoes and you are never more english than in a situation like that i'm standing there going god i hope he doesn't buy them i've got literally nothing else to wear um so anyway we're going to crack on um because you've all got your own shopping to do uh, we're going to today, um, the first Virtual Vendors Award, obviously, we'll be celebrating the very best from across the vending industry, from innovative products and machines to outstanding operators and the professionals at the heart of these companies. Before we get underway with the presentation, it's over to Vending International's editor, Heather Ramsden, to say a few words. Hello and welcome to the Vendies 2021. It's such a pleasure to have the vending industry joining us today even though it has to be virtually. The impact of the last year on business has been devastating and we all know vending has suffered more than its fair share of hardships. But from what I have seen, this industry is hardworking, determined and resilient and that surely puts vending in a great position to bounce back. One thing's for sure, in spite of the setbacks of the past 12 months, innovation didn't die and customer service was still delivered at an exemplary level. There are so many excellent examples of this in today's lineup of finalists, and there has never been a better time than now to celebrate and reward your efforts after such testing times. We were so fortunate to have a highly experienced panel of judges tasked with choosing the most outstanding candidates, and we are very grateful for their time and expertise. We also extend our gratitude to all our sponsors, without whom we would not be able to put on this show. I do hope you enjoy this, the first ever virtual Vendies, and we really look forward to welcoming you in person for the Vendies 2022. Thank you, Heather. Uh, we hope you've all enjoyed getting involved in the pre-show social wall sponsored by Barry Calbor. Uh, we'll be continuing to run the live social wall throughout the ceremony thanks to sponsor Abby Chart. So make sure you share your celebrations and congratulations on Twitter using the hashtag TheVendies for a chance to be featured and 
If you're lucky enough to win today, you can expect to receive your trophy in the post very shortly. So snap a picture of you and your team and share it with us. To help me reveal the winners today, we've got none other than the National Lottery's voice of the Bulls, Alan Dedico. Ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely, Ian. Good afternoon, folks. I am indeed the National Lottery's voice of the Bulls, and I'm the voice of Strictly Come Dancing, which returns to your screens in the autumn. The judges have their scores. Craig Revelwald, that's one of mine. It's an absolute pleasure to be with you today. As you'll hear, my task is to list the nominees in each of the 17 categories in this year's Vendies Awards. So listen out for your company or organisation as we go along, won't you? We are about to start, so stand by. Ian, it's back to you. Thanks, Alan. Now it's the moment you've all been waiting for, the Vendies 2021. Our first category of this afternoon is Best Beverage Brand. Ian, the finalists in this category are Virtual Tea, Cadbury New Hot Chocolate Vending Blend, Radnor Infusions, and Radnor Splash. We have a highly commended in this category, which goes to Cadbury New Hot Chocolate Vending Blend. Congratulations to them. But the winner of Best Beverage Brand is Virtual Tea. Discover superior tasting tea from Virtual. Our plant-based tea bags contain the finest estate-grown leaves from our Great Rift Loose Leaf Blend. You'll enjoy tea that's always bold, bright and bursting with flavour. Award-winning tea for every day by Birchall. Delivered to your door from birchalltea.co.uk. Up next is the award for the best supplier website. Alan, please tell us who's in the running to win today. The finalists in this category, Ian, are Coffee Tech, Evoca, H2O Direct, Vionet Smart Machines, and Westomatic Vending Services Limited. Highly commended in this category is H2O Direct. Congratulations to them. But the winner of Best Supplier website is Coffee Tech. Now it's time for the first of today's operator categories, Best Regional Operator, sponsored by Tower Leasing. And the finalists in this category are Alpine Vending Company Limited, Excel Vending, Express Vending, and SV247 Vending. Highly commended in this category is Express Vending Limited. And to reveal the winner, it's over to Tower Leasing's Head of Vending, Kevin Reed. You're all winners with Tower Leasing. It gives me great pleasure to announce the winner. The best regional operator is... Splendid XL Vending.
next is the hotly contested award for Best Machine Innovation. Alan, who's in the running? Ian, the eight finalists in this category are Albert's Smoothie and Soup Stations, Albert's. Distance Selection, Coffee Tech. Foodies Food Market, operated by Selecta. Gadja La Radiosa, Evoca. Keros, Rio Vendors Group, SBA. Maski Mini, Flavura, Germany. Micro injected air milk technology, Vitro M5, Coffee Tech. And Mobile Locker, Mobile Locker NV. Highly commended in this category is Distance Selection, Coffee Tech. Congratulations. And the winner of Best Machine Innovation is Albert's Smoothie and Soup Stations by Albert's. Congratulations to Albert's combining food technology and robotics to make a vending machine that can help people meet their daily nutritional needs on the go. Vending robots aren't like the traditional vending machines that mostly focus on pre-made treats and snacks. What makes our vending machines unique is that it is controlled via an app giving people full control over which fresh ingredients they put into their smoothies. With the smoothie station, we focused on zero waste. We're moving on now to best payment system. We are indeed, and the finalists are 365 Pay App, 365 Retail Markets. Hi, Evoca. Matty Pay, Matty Pay SRL. Smart Contact, Vianet. Valina, Worldline. VMC Flex, VMC UK Limited and Vipaz Touch, Nyax. Highly commended in this category is the 365 Pay App from 365 Retail Markets. Congratulations to them. And the winner of Best Payment System is Vipaz Touch, Nyax. Nyax. Bridge the gap in the unattended market to transform your unattended point of sales into a friendly 24-7 neighborhood store. Enable consumer engagement while offering limitless cashless payment capabilities around the globe. Boost consumer satisfaction through surveys, FDA and EU ingredient and calorie guidelines, instant refunds and e-receipts. Now it's time for the Best Healthy Product Award, sponsored by 365 Retail Markets. Hi, we are 365 Retail Markets, the global leader in self-service convenient technologies. We work with the top food service operators around the world, helping to facilitate their success and meet consumer snacking and meal needs. Our combination of customizable, flexible, convenience technologies have enhanced consumer experiences and innovated the vending industry. We are better together. And this time round, the finalists are Albert's Smoothies, Albert's. Radnor Infusions, Radnor Hills and sour cream and chive lentil waves, Burt's Snacks. Highly commended in this category is Albert Smoothies. But to reveal the winner, it's over to 365 Retail Markets International Programme Manager, Jeff Veers. The award for best healthy products goes to Burt's Snacks. Congratulations on a job well done. Next is the award for best ancillary product or service. Alan, please tell us who's in the running. Absolutely, Ian. The finalists are BioGuard VendShield Clear Abbey Chart, IEN and VHIEN range of filters, H2O Direct, IX Filter, European Water Care Limited, Remanufacture, Westomatic Vending Services Limited, 
Revolutionizing VenPay's business model with eSci's ubiquitous global AnyNet connectivity, eSci. Take 5, MattyPay SRL. Vending Consultancy, Optimus Associates. And Vend Manager, SB Software. Highly commended in this category goes to Take 5, MattyPay SRL. But the winner of Best Ancillary Product or Service is SB Software for Vend Manager. We're moving on now to the award for Best Snack Confectionery Product. The finalists in this category are Cadbury Twirl Orange, Mondelez International. Gluten-free and vegan ambient spiced fruit granola, the handmade cake company. And Levi Root's Reggae Reggae Groove Cut Crisps, Burt's Snacks. Highly commended in this category is the gluten-free and vegan ambient spice fruit granola from the Handmade Cake Company. The winner of Best Snack Confectionery product is Mondelez International for the Cadbury Twirl Orange. Every time Dave talks into his Cadbury Dairy Milk, he supports 100% sustainably sourced cocoa. Every chunk helps cocoa farmers earn a better living. He's been doing it for years. He didn't even know it. Nice one, Dave. Now it's time for the award for Best Sustainable Product, sponsored by Coffee Tech. And here's who's in the running. Abbey Chart Chiller Refurbishment. Birchall Great Rift Breakfast Blend. One kilogram loose leaf tea, Birchall. H2O Hydration Station, Westomatic Vending Services Limited. Clicks Eco Cups, Lavazza Professional UK. Maskey, Maskey. Remanufacture, Westomatic Vending Services Limited. Sipple Hydration Station, designed and manufactured by Iguana. And Vico, the Young Duke. Highly commended in this category is Clix Eco Cups from Lavazza Professional UK. Congratulations. To reveal the winner, it's over to Coffee Tech's sale director, Ian Johnston. The winner is Iguana. Next is the award for Best Area Manager, sponsored by Abbey Chart. The finalists are Gary Bailey, 
Express Vending Limited and Rachel Weber, Express Vending Limited. Thank you, Alan. Now to reveal the winner, it's over to Abbey Chart Sales Director Nigel Barron. The award for the best area manager goes to Rachel Weber, Express Vending. Time now for a new and hotly contested category, the Corporate Social Responsibility Award, sponsored by Mondelez International. Every time Dave talks into his Cadbury Dairy Milk, he supports 100% sustainably sourced cocoa. Every chunk has helped plant over a million trees all around the world. He's been doing it for years. He didn't even know it. Nice one, Dave. And here's who the finalists are. Amos Coffee and Tea Limited. Cafe Prego Coffee Company Limited. Evoca. Lavazza Professional UK. Matty Pay SRL. RBC Group and Westomatic. Highly commended in this category goes to Evoca. Congratulations. But to reveal the winner, it's over to Mondelez International's Customer Development Manager for Vending, Joanne Roffey. The winner is Cafe Prego Coffee Company. Up next is the Customer Service Award supplier. Alan, please tell us who's in the running. Ian, the finalists are 365 Retail Markets Customer Support Team, Abbey Chart, Coffee Tech Technical Support Team, Evoca Commercial Team, H2O Direct Customer Service, Tower Leasing Limited, Vend Manager, SB Software Customer Service Team and Westomatic Technical Support and Account Management. Highly commended in this category goes to Vend Manager, SB Software Customer Service Team. Congratulations. And finally, the winner of the Customer Service Award supplier is Tower Leasing Limited. time for the best service engineer category sponsored by Barry Calibor and we have three incredible individuals in the running to win. The finalists are Craig Mitchell, SV247 Vending, 
Mark Mackay, Express Vending Limited, and Pratap Gami, Express Vending Limited. Congratulations to the highly commended in this category, Express Vending's Pratap Gami. But to reveal the winner, it's over to Barry Calbo's National Account Manager, Gareth Fitzpatrick. The winner of Best Service Engineer is Craig Mitchell from SV247 Vending. Now we come to our final product category, the coveted Best New Product Award. Alan, who have we got here? Some interesting products here, Ian. The finalists are Cadbury Twirl Orange, Mondelez International, Cheeky Chock Hazelnut Norbles, Creative Nature, Columna H2O Touch, Zerica, Masky, Masky, Radnor Hills 330ml Can Still Spring Water, Radnor Hills, and Rustler's Cooking Box, Keypack. Congratulations to Maskey, highly commended in this category. And the winner of Best New Product is Cadbury Twirl Orange from Mondelez International. Every time Dave tucks into his Cadbury Dairy Milk, he supports 100% sustainably sourced cocoa. Every chunk has helped teach over 100,000 cocoa farmers how to protect the environment. He's been doing it for years. He didn't even know it. Nice one, Dave. It's time for our final operator category, Best Overall Operator, sponsored by SB Software. And the list of finalists looks like this. Excel Vending. Express Vending Limited. Doozy Vending. And SV247 Vending. Highly commended in this category is Express Vending Limited. Congratulations. But to reveal the winner, it's over to SB Software's Head of Business Development, Robin Turver. The best overall operator is Excel Vending. Our penultimate category today is a new introduction, industry personality. Today's recipient needs no introduction in vending circles. In fact, his larger than life personality has been a hit at every vending meeting, show or social event over a number of years. There are very few people within vending who've not rubbed shoulders with today's winner, who is always ready with a smile or cracking a joke, while at the same time offering some valuable financial business advice. Many of you will have your own special anecdotes about this person. You may even recall him leaping into a swimming pool clad in a black tie suit at a recent vending event. By now I'm sure you all know who we're talking about. Today's winner of the Industry Personality Award is Kevin Reed, ladies and gentlemen. We're closing out today's ceremony with another new introduction, the Outstanding Contribution Award. 
which recognises an individual who has demonstrated an unrivalled passion for the vending industry and contributed a great deal to the sector as a whole. This year's recipient, after being diagnosed with cancer in 2014, decided to take a stand against the food choices available to time-poor people, passionately believing that we all have a right to quick, honest and tasty food. So he started a food company. Together with his team, he developed not only an award-winning brand of noodles, but also an innovative, interactive noodle kiosk, providing a 24-7 healthy, hot food option. Sadly, this passionate businessman and family man passed away in early 2021 after battling courageously through the challenges of cancer for over six years. His energy, enthusiasm, creativity, twinkling rebelliousness and his deeply caring nature are an inspiration to us all. The inaugural Outstanding Contribution Award goes to Damien Lee of Mr Lee's Pure Foods. Ladies and gentlemen, that's it for this year's Vendy's Awards Ceremony. A huge congratulations to all of the finalists and winners and a massive thank you to our amazing sponsors for making this celebration possible. Finally, thank you to all of you for watching or for tuning in for today's ceremony. We'll continue to run the social wall for a further 30 minutes, so make sure you get involved by tweeting hashtag TheVendies. That's it from me, and we'll see you again next year. <laughs>